like uh, when they announced it. Right? You were kind of looking forward to it. I remember you talking about it earlier. You were immediately, you mentioned that. It's I love joint practices. Yeah. I love them. Uh, growing up, um, being drafted by New England, did one or two every year. Uh, do a couple here now. So I look forward to it. I mean, I get tired of uh, talking to our guys every day. I mean, me and Adam Humphreys, every single rep of every game, every practice is getting old. So it's good to go against somebody new and uh, try to figure them out and try to get in their head. Will you miss him if he's not uh, if he's not here? Well, if uh, I guess he's still hurt, but if Julian doesn't show, will you will you miss seeing him this week? I'm sure I'll see him in some uh, form or fashion, whether he's practicing or not. I have no idea. Um, I hope he is, uh, but if he's not, I hope he gets healthy. Can you guys get better in these next two days than you can at any point during the preseason and training camp with the head-to-head -head practices? Yeah, you can always get better. I push myself, so it doesn't matter. Uh, you know, whether I'm covering Humphreys, Edelman, practice, game. It's, it's a rep to push yourself. And uh, in football, you practice more than you play. You only have 16 opportunities, um, hopefully, if you're healthy enough throughout the, the season. So uh, we got to take our practices very serious, which we do. Are you yeah, at a special meeting just because it's the Patriots you guys are going to practice against? And you, you did that routine for many years up there? No, it's not a special meeting. It's a lot of familiar faces, um, a lot of competitive juices. They're a competitive organization to the, the world champions last year. So it's just good to go against that and uh, see where you stack up. and. Uh, uh, bring your A game and see how they stack up against that as well. Any guilt for you guys for what you're doing to your offense every day out there? I mean, these guys are your teammates. No, we're competing, man. We're, we're, we're competing, and uh, they're making plays. We're making plays. It, it's practice. You know, we're just trying to make them better uh, so they can put some points up on Sunday, a ton of points up, and they're pushing us, um, you know, to, to, to be the top defense in the league, and that's our goal. You guys seem like a very confident bunch uh, at this point. We love football, and Vrabel says, you know, it's week three of training camp, and you're going to find out when it's 100 degrees uh, on the 14th practice or whatever it is, if you love it or not. Um, if you're in the tub, icing up, and don't feel like practicing. If you're out here, if you're talking and you're having fun, you're dancing, it seems like you love football, and I love what I do, and uh, take it really serious. So when you make plays, you want to celebrate. Do you love it any more or less now this deep into your career, do you think? Uh, I, I mean, uh, have being injured last year, I, I – Definitely don't take it for granted. I appreciate it. And having kids and uh, being a, the role of a provider for my family, um, I take that very seriously, just like everyone else here does. So I just take it like it's my, my, my profession. I put my heart and soul into it. It's not all of me. Obviously, I do a lot more off the field. I'm a husband, a father, and animal rescue, and everything like that. So it's not all of me, but I take it very seriously because of my profession and my last name's on it.